Hey, you got Dave here from Unipro. In this video, I'm gonna share with you how to fill up your Facebook audience with ultra-targeted prospects. So these are people who fit perfectly in your niche. They want whatever it is, whatever product or service that you're selling. How to put those people into your audience, how to do this day after day, and how to do it for free. Let's dive in. So one of the problems that I see online business owners run into is the fact that they don't have a big audience. And specifically when we're talking about Facebook, we know that your Facebook, your personal Facebook audience, like your friends on Facebook, that's your best audience. You know, there used to be a strategy where we'd, you know, build up a business page and get a lot of followers, a lot of likes, a lot of fans on that business page. But that strategy is very outdated just because we know business pages, they don't get any reach anymore. But what does get reach are your personal posts. And so it's really important to fill up your personal Facebook audience with hot prospects. Now, you may know that you have 5,000 friend spots in your, in your personal Facebook profile. And so it's ultra important that you fill up those 5,000 spots with prospects. Imagine it like this. Imagine that you were doing a speaking engagement and you were speaking in an auditorium that had 5,000 seats and you walked out on stage, you had this awesome speech prepared and you started your speech and you looked out at the audience and there was a hundred people in the audience. Like how deflated would you feel? You put all this work into your content and nobody's seeing it. And that's exactly what business owners are doing every single day. They're spending all this time creating content, posting it on their personal Facebook profile and nobody's seeing it simply because their audience is too small. Or the other problem is that business owners are building up their friend list. They're adding people to their audience, but they're not real prospects. You know, they're actually just friends and family or random people who they connected with in some random Facebook group, but it's not targeted prospects. And that's what we want to fix. We want to fill up your Facebook audience every single day with targeted prospects. So how do we do that? Well, let me show you by using an example here. I'm going to use a friend and a client of mine, Dave Morrow here. And as you can see, this is on his personal Facebook profile and he gets it. He understands that he's going to get reach. He's going to get attention. He's going to start conversations. He's going to be able to nurture leads by bringing those prospects into his personal world on Facebook. And so on his personal profile, you can see here, Dave's a fitness coach and he targets, targets military, primarily military men who are looking to get in better shape. And so Dave wants to fill up his audience with military people. How does he do that? Well, before before I show you that, I'm going to show you a cool post Dave made. And he posted this in our Unipro Facebook group. This is for clients who are using our Unipro software. He said, um, can anyone guess when I started Unipro based on this uh, graph here? I'm going to show you the graph here. And this is the membership in Dave's Facebook group. So he's taking these military men or military people who are joining him on Facebook on his personal profile. They're becoming friends. They're filling up those 5,000 friend spots that he's got. And the, Dave's migrating those people over into his Facebook group. So now not only is he getting targeted leads as personal friends of his on Facebook, but he's able to move them over into his group. And you can see how this strategy is working. His group is absolutely blowing up. But this can only be done if he's getting a daily source of leads who are these targeted prospects. So where are these prospects coming from and how can you do this as well? Well, I'm going to go over to Facebook here and you can see that up in the top corner here, I did a search. So I just went to Facebook search and I just typed in military Canada. And the reason why I did this is like I said, Dave, he's targeting military guys and Dave's from Canada. And so this could be potentially a great search for him. As I scroll down here, let's take a look at some of these posts. So these are posts that are talking about Canadian military. This one's got 2,200 likes. This one's got 959 likes. This one's got 4,000 likes. This one's got 2,000 likes. This one's got 1,200 likes. So there's all these posts that are targeting Canadian military. Well, who's likely engaging with content like this? I know it's not me. I've never been in the military. I don't know anything about the military. It's probably ex-military or existing military. And because I searched for Canada, this is content that's targeting Canadian military. So what this tells us is that these 2,200 people who engaged on this, there's a very high likelihood that they're either in the military or they're ex-military. These are exactly the type of prospects that Dave wants to bring over into his personal audience so then he can move them over into his Facebook group at some point. So what do I do with this? Well, I'll show you a manual way and it's really simple as you can click on the engagement here and Facebook's gonna pull up a list of everyone who engaged. And literally I could go back to this post on a daily basis and just start adding friends here. I can manually go through and click and add friends. Now, I'm not gonna do this. I'm not targeting Canadian military, but Dave could go and do this and every single day add a few more friends and build up his audience of these targeted prospects. And this is completely for free. So that's the manual way to do it. Well, now I'm gonna show you the way that the pros are doing it. 
So we used to do this exact same process and then we didn't have time for it anymore. And so we outsourced that and we had virtual assistants doing that. And then we started asking the question, well, what would it look like if we sped this process up by automating it? And I'll show you what we're doing now. I'm gonna go over here and this is our Una Pro software. And I'm gonna go through that exact same process. First thing that I wanna do though, is I'm gonna go back to this post and I'm gonna click on these three dots and I'm gonna click on save post. And you'll see that it comes up with a screen here that allows me to add that post to a collection. And what I recommend is creating a new collection called prospecting or something like that. And you can see I've already got my prospecting collection here. So I'm gonna add that post to my prospecting collection. And now whenever I see a post, if I was Dave Mora, whenever I see a post or search and find a post that's targeting Canadian military, I just keep adding those to my prospecting folder, my collection there. And you can just imagine each of these posts might have a thousand or 2000 or 3000 or 4000 people who've engaged. This becomes a huge number of prospects that Dave can use to move over into his personal audience and eventually into his group. What do I do with that now? Well, let's go back over to Unipro. And what I want to do is tell the software here, how many of these friend requests do I want to send out and how quickly do I want to send those friend requests? Now for me, I send out 50 friend requests every single day. And I just know that I'm going to get about 20 of those that are going to accept. And so I'm constantly building up my audience. I'm going to set this. I'm going to send a friend request every 10 to 15 seconds. And so then literally I'm going to click on find post and I'm going to go over to my save posts. And lo and behold, there's that post. Let me just make this a little bit bigger for you. There's that post that I just saved. So I'm gonna click on that post and Unipro is gonna load up that post. And when I scroll down, you're gonna notice something here. You're gonna see this green box and a flashing red light. And this is basically Unipro saying to me, like Dave, there's leads here. And so I'm gonna click on that and you'll notice this screen comes up with all the leads or all the people who engaged on this post. And now I can simply just click on start. Or if I wanna get even more targeted, I can tell Unipro to send requests to only people who I have mutual friends with. And that just increases the likelihood that they're gonna accept my friend request. And Facebook likes this because it sees I'm not just sending out friend requests to random people, it's people who we have something in common with. And so now I can just start up the software and Unipro is gonna start scrolling through there. It's gonna be making a list of people to send friend requests to. And I'm gonna stop this because I don't actually wanna target Canadian military, but that's it. Now I can go work on something else and Unipro does the work for me. So that's how the pros are automating this process, but I want to go back to Facebook search because I want to show you how this strategy can work for any niche. So I'm going to go back to my search here and let's just say that you were targeting people who are interested in NFTs. You had an NFT project coming up and you wanted to sell it. What I'm going to do is go down to posts and this is really important is you want to filter your posts by posts from public posts. So you can see all public posts. And I'm just going to scroll down here. And what I do is I'm, as I'm scrolling, I'm just looking for ones that get a lot of engagement. So I'm going to scroll down here uh, and here's one. So this one's got almost 900 engagements on it. And so then what I would do is I would take this post and then I would add it over to, I would save it to my save collection. And I would just keep on searching here for more NFT related posts that I know my, pro my ideal prospects are going to congregate on. And then I can build up my save list of all these posts where I've got tons of prospects. So that's how I could do it for NFTs. Let's Imagine I'm going to use the niche that I'm in, which is online, actually I'm going to call digital marketing. Let's do digital marketing here and let's see what comes up. Same thing, I'm going to go to posts and then I'm going to filter this again by posts from and go down to public posts and let's scroll through here. So I'm looking for big engagement. So this one right here, 2400 and learn how to earn 100 to 200K monthly in affiliate marketing. So maybe these people who are interested in affiliate marketing would be interested in digital products uh, like we offer. And so this one, think about the numbers here is I could save this to my collection, 2,400 engagements on this, 2,400 people. And when I run Unipro, I'm sending out 50 friend requests per day. So this single post gives me enough leads or prospects to be reaching out to you on a daily basis for day after day after day after day. And you can just imagine after you put a couple of these posts into your collection, you can run this. This could be almost an endless stream of prospects for your business. So that's the strategy I have for you today. If you have any questions or comments about this strategy, just drop those below. If you're interested in checking out Unipro, maybe you want to try it out for yourself. You can go to unipro.com or you can check out the link in the description below. And if this added any value to you, give this video a like, subscribe to the channel. And before you go, I'm going to give you one more video that you're probably going to want to watch. So I'll see you over there.